Hello guys, my name is JP and welcome to Solar 2. This game is a little... little tricky to explain. <clears throat> that step, that... Oh, oh god, that's not allowed. Okay, that was, that was louder than I expected. I am an asteroid. Tutorial, use arrow keys or WASD to move around. Come here. Or toggle. Is this, this? Okay, it is. Come here, bitch. Get back here. Gotcha. Oh, the music is so loud. Hold on. That's what happens when you go into a game without doing any any settings first. Press escape and pause. Escape to pause and bring up the menu. Some useful things there. Yeah, I already did that. Hey, that was mine. Ah, we hit the planet. That's your fault. I don't know who's watching. It's your fault, either way. I'm not even doing the tutorial. Oh, what's this? Let's follow the arrows, okay. Can board a mission with backspace and delete. Okay, that's interesting. I did actually did not know that. Since when does this game have goals? You're just supposed to be an asteroid and get bigger. Oh. Best friend mass? They need your help? What? Oh, where'd it go? <laughs> okay. Was I supposed to try to get it or something? I am a planet. Now, when you're a planet, you have to capture things in orbit instead of just running into things. Move alongside asteroids and bring them in orbit, just like I did. Space bar to absorb one at a time. Or L to absorb them all. Okay. I'll take those. How weird would it be? How weird would it be if the universe actually worked like this? Where planets randomly just float around looking for things to absorb as if they're alive. Kind of creepy. Just a little creepy. Let's go this way, I guess. There's an asteroid field. I'm gonna stop and get some more asteroids. Got a bad case of the asteroids here. Now it's also useful to have some just kind of hanging out, because uh, they'll work as a shield in case you, in case you get going, like through an asteroid field, and if there are uh, things could run into you, instead they'll just knock away your asteroids. Come on. Yep. We're getting kind of big here. And you need a lot of them. I don't remember it taking this long before. What's down here? More asteroids, for one thing. How much would that freak out NASA if they found a planet that just is floating out there like this, randomly changing orbit? No! It's mine! Bastard. Here's the thing. The solar system sculpture is over 150 trillion years old. It's a divine example of new cosmological design. Okay. Ok. 
Okay, get all the, the asteroid moons, but don't touch anything else. Oh, that's impossible. Come on. That can't be done. I'm not big enough to just steal asteroids yet. Whatever. We don't need to do that. Too difficult. This isn't safe. I shouldn't be here. They'll shoot at me. Let's just keep getting bigger for a while. There we go. Now I have life. Wow. Apparently life will sometimes be a pest. Let's grab some asteroids. Yeah, now I have little, uh, little guys doing my dirty work for me. I got one of them. They need to watch out for the asteroids. I have a shield. The shield is now charged, just about. But yeah, this is what the game is. Uh, oh, man, my shield. This is the basis of the game. Uh, you just gather bits and become bigger. It's actually pretty hypnotic. Addictive, if you will. Uh, when I first got this, I got—I actually have this on Xbox 360. That was the first place I ever got it. And I just sat there for, for hours and hours and played this. Stop shooting my asteroids, asshole! I used to sit here forever and play this game, and let's just say it, it can't possibly be healthy for me. Kill it! Haha! -ha. Get him! Come on, where's my other guy? Oh no. It's a fight. I don't know how this works. How do planets fight each other? That's it's weird. Oh, ow, okay, I'm leaving. Oop, I gotta I got a text. I got a text. I wonder who it's from. Oh, what the hell are these? These are a different color. This is this is too This is too exciting for Hey look, I found the, the title. So now we know that somewhere in the universe there are the giant words of Solar 2 floating around. I need, I need to let my shield recharge for a while. Oh, ah, hey, don't shoot those things. Hey, I need those. Dex. The thing is, until I, uh... Until I become a star, the only thing I can really capture is asteroids. As soon as I become a star, I can capture those little planets, the smaller planets. Which makes things a lot easier. See, this is a solar system. 
We don't want anything to do with that guy. I'm almost at a star, though. A little bit farther. Oh, that guy died. Oh, I'm a star now. Let's capture this guy. Oh, I'm supposed to capture it, not, not suck it in like that and die. So the problem is I can't capture, uh, I can't capture asteroids anymore. But fortunately for me, the way the game works is now, now suddenly planets are very plentiful. But I have to use planets to capture asteroids. Which can be a little tricky. But actually, I can also... If I kept doing that with the asteroids, making that other star... Other, the other star, the other planet bigger, I can also... I can become a binary star system by making that one bigger. Made that shot. Oh no! Stupid asteroid. But yes, you can do this all the way up through becoming a black hole. And once you go in a black hole, you can keep getting bigger until you absorb the entire universe. Uh, I don't intend to play it that long. This is more of like a little mini review deal. But, uh, so let's, let's give this a little review. As far as something important for most games these days is controls. Pretty good. Uh, it's definitely playable. I'm sitting here at WASD and like L and spacebar. Oop, I just ate a planet. Oh well. Fuck off. Uh, playability good. Graphics good. Performance very good. I'm sitting here, I didn't touch the graphics settings, it did it all automatically, and it's planet perfect. Which is a very good sign. Can I have that planet, please? Oh, my god. That shouldn't happen in real life. Oh, that was mine, bitch. Uh, objectives, it, it actually manages to have objectives, which I found very strange. Uh, look. Like I said, when I first played this on Xbox 360, you didn't have goals like that. It was just kind of, okay, you're an asteroid, have fun. Now it's very, almost kind of dr goal-driven. It has a lot of things you can do. Uh, replay value. It has infinite replay value because right here, I could stop, I can save... And always have this as a file for myself. Just always play it from here. Which is usually what I'll do. I'll play, uh... I'll play for a while and save, like, at each stage of... development. Like, uh, when I become a planet, when I become a life planet, a star, a large star, bl a black hole. Like, I'll save at each point like that. If I want to play a particular thing that day, I can just play it instead of having to wait around... And I do believe there are cheats. Yes, you can change the, the gravity, uh, certain things of it. Uh, it does have story and challenges, which is cool. It has a, it has a whole achievement system, just like most games on Steam these days. Controls, arrows, or WASD for left-handed or right-handed, which is good, because I know a lot of people are actually left-handed. Not that that's... That's a bad thing or anything. Options. Uh, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna mess with the resolution stuff because I'm. I'm actively playing it. You know the deal. But yeah, 
Uh, let's go ahead and save. Response the system. Save current system. See? Like this, I can always select this one and, re and spawn as it. Like that'll always come back as this. <laughs> Which is very cool for... Unlocks when you can reach... Yeah. This is cheats, pretty much. But yes, you have an unprecedented amount of control, considering you're supposed to be a planet. Or star, or whatever. Whoop. But yes, that is my review. Uh, this is a very... Very interesting game. As far as what you're supposed to do with it... Uh, I couldn't tell you. Like I said, you just kind of float around and absorb things. Uh, it claims to have a story now, but I haven't played it in a long time. I didn't realize it had a story. Where you going, guy? They blew up my planet. They blew up my planet. You bastards. It's like they killed Kenny. Give me that. Anyways, that'll do it for today. Thank you for watching. My name is JP, and I'll see you around. Thanks for watching.